Welcome back. We are here with part five of our royal family fourth generation, and today we are going to ruin some lives as promised. So we are here at the nightclub with Diane Perryton, Duchess Diane Perryton, and she is, you know, looking to have some fun. And who does she start talking to? But um, Howard of Newcrest. His parents are the Duke and one of the Dukes and Duchesses. And so he is actually pretty young. I think actually he's at the end of his teen years, but he is out here. He is actually not going to be able to inherit a title. So he is scoping it out for trying to getting, you know, someone who can help him get a little more power, a little stronger of a foothold. And Octavia, Octavia, you're not supposed to be here. Um, anyway. Um, so these two are chatting, you know, they're both feeling kind of flirty, they're enjoying each other's company, and, um, you know, just kind of putting themselves out there. Diane, of course, does have a husband, Brian, who she is, you know, she's an evil sim, so she is not quite faithful to him. And, um, you know, Diane probably has uh, some feelings because... Um, her, both her mother and her aunt were killed by Luna, the vampire, because they went over there like idiots to try and, like, become a vampire or something. Terry, um, Terry was not the brightest bulb on the tree, but, um, you know, she definitely does not have any good examples of a happy, healthy relationship, so she is going to... Uh, if, you know, he would stop leaving, um, if he, there we go, okay, so they're back, and, um, they're flirting with each other, he's gone again, <laughs> okay, you know, we're gonna go home, um, we're gonna go home and then call him over, so, anyway, these two have woohooed, they are, you know, having a little affair, and, um, he wants to be a duke, and he can't get that from his family. So he's probably thinking, you know, like, oh, well, hey, Diane, you know, if I marry you, I could become the Duke. And he's, you know, coming up with all those plans. And he's thinking that, like, you know, if maybe he can be with Diane and their, you know, children could inherit or something like that. So definitely, um, you know, Newcrest is a little more cutthroat than our kingdom, so that is definitely a difference in mindset here, and um, so we are going to just move him in for ease here, but anyway, him and Diane are having this full-fledged affair, and Brian, who is the current duke, is going to walk in on them and see that his wife is with someone else, and he's like, what the hell, and you know, um, Howard was hoping that they would get caught. Like, he wants to get rid of Brian. He doesn't, you know, Brian's in his way of getting what he wants. And Diane, I mean, she loves her husband in, in a way. It was kind of an arranged marriage. But, um, you know, she she's evil. She's not the nicest sim. Um, so they are going to get mad at each other. And then Howard is going to kill Brian Diane's like, I'm out of here, these crazy people. Um, so that was actually fast, Grim. Thank you very much. Um, so we have his gravestone, and basically um, Howard is like, Diane, now we can be together. And she's like, well, uh, actually, and she tells him that she is not the Duchess because she inherited that title. She's the Duchess because she married into it. So if he married her, that doesn't make him the Duke. I mean, he could be acting Duke right now because she's acting Duchess until her daughter is old enough, but that doesn't make him the Duke. And he's like, obviously, off his rocker here because he just, um, you know, was having a fling with her and then was like, let's get married. <laughs> and um, actually, for some reason, the, the even like boyfriend, girlfriend doesn't show up on the menu here. I'm not really sure why. So anyway, I guess they're just having a relationship and nothing is going to be made perfectly official. Let's say that um, our king, Gohan, is like, excuse me? <laughs> no. And so he doesn't bless their marriage or whatever. So um, that is, 
Yeah, I can't find the thing. Anyway, so we have poor Kayla. Is that her name? Kayla? We have poor little Kayla down here. And Howard is going to come down and tell Kayla, like, here's how it is. So he says, you know, um, he's taking his sweet time coming down here. But anyway, so he's going to talk to Kayla while Diana's asleep. And he's going to say to Kayla, you know, I'm your dad now. And I'm in charge now. I'm the Duke. And uh, there's nothing you can do about it. And when Diana and I have children, you're going to be out of here. Like, you're not going to get to inherit, blah, 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 blah. And so um, he is really mean to her. And obviously he's short-sighted and not smart. He's also, you know... Diana's a regular adult, and he's just a young adult now, like barely a young adult. So um, he's obviously not the, the brightest bulb on the tree here. So he is fighting with Kayla and just kind of, you know, causing animosity here. And he keeps telling her, like, you know, you can, you can get lost. Like, I'm going to have kids with Diane, and they're going to inherit and we're going to figure something out and we're going to, you know, but what he does not know <laughs> is Diane is actually quite close to becoming an elder and she is going through menopause. So she is actually not having any more babies. I um, have gone into create a sim and put neither for babies. So she's actually not having any kids with him, but he doesn't know that that's going to be a later him problem when he's very upset about it, that they haven't had any kids, but you know what? That's what you get for being stupid. So anyway, we are going to drop off Brian's urn here. That is basically the first part of this video where we are here with the Perryton family. As you know, if you've been watching this Let's Play uh, from the beginning, the, there is such a thing as called the Perryton Curse. Now, the Perryton Curse is that no Perryton heir makes it past their, like their children. They never see their children become teenagers is what it is. So there you go. Brian did not get to see Kayla become a teenager. So that is part of the curse. And now Howard is going to be living with Diane and Kayla, and that sucks for Kayla. So, I mean, I'm sure Brian will, you know, probably leave once he realizes that Diane's not going to give him what he wants. But uh, he's he's not, he's not uh, in that place yet, so... We are back here with the royal family for the rest of the video, and we are just going to work a little bit on everyone's aspirations. We have Octavia, who is working on the inner peace aspiration, and she's actually doing really good at it. This one isn't very hard. Um, so she is going to... Um, what's this? She needs to have like the nice areas. So she has to listen to music and do incense and stuff like that. Gohan is working on his speech for his career. He needs to, to practice speech for his thing. Honestly, though, I think there's something wrong with the, like, there's some kind of bug, because Gohan, even when Gabriel goes to work, or goes to school, it, like, does that thing where you can see the two, the little briefcase, and then the little person, and then it goes away about halfway through the day, and then it does not count them as, like, they don't get any progress towards work or school after that little thing goes away, so I don't know what is kind of bug that is, but something we're dealing with and um, I tried to pick a new gig for Octavia to have a charity party but unfortunately I cannot figure out how to do that like I tried to throw a charity party and there's no options to do that I tried to ask people for donations there's no option to do that so I really don't know what's the deal with that but yeah no we're just moving on so Octavia is actually going to read some gardening books because I want to evolve our money trees, but you can't do that unless you're gardening level two. So we're going to get her up to level two and then be all set there. And then evolve our tree. And let's also have her donate money to charity anyway, because, you know, she's the, she has the patronage of charity or whatever it is from the, from Kiara Sims Royal Family Mod. And then, yeah, see how the little people disappeared on both of them who are at work and school right now? I don't know what's up with that. Anyway, um, so Gabriel has, like, honor student aspiration or whatever. So he wants to get help with homework three times. He also needs to play some games on the computer, but he can't play all of them because he needs to get a higher mental skill in order to play the other game. We'll work on that. 
and we are going to bring Octavia over there so that he can practice his homework, or she can help him with his homework, and she doesn't have to walk across the whole castle. So here we go on that, and then we'll help him with his homework. Good, good. He's a good boy. He's very studious. Um, so he also brought home a school project, so we'll have him work on that too. And then also we have a little journal here, which is super cute, and I figured we should have him, you know, go into his journal. Also, his inventory is messed up somehow. Don't know what's up with that. Anyway, so let's get the project outside, and we'll work on that as well. And then there we go. We've leveled up in that. And then um, Gohan actually i gave him the super parent aspiration i don't know how much of that we're going to get done we'll we'll think about it so um anyway we're going to have octavia listen to new age once again just trying to get those those 40 items which is fine it's just you know it'd be easy to just click through them really quickly but i don't want to do that either so now we're gonna have our kid blow some bubbles love that he loves it too. And actually, we're also going to give um, Gabriel the Crown Prince title. You can see it there. And he, I mean, he is the only prince right now. So obviously he's first in line for the throne anyway. But yeah, so he is the Crown Prince. And that is good. He'll become the king after Gohan dies. I'm not really sure how the mod handles that if he like automatically becomes king or something we'll have to see what happens but anyway so we are working on our school project and making that do good i don't know what gohan's doing he's just sitting there oh okay we're gonna actually read some parenting because he wants to get to level four parenting so let's have him read a parenting book and work on that i actually wasn't sure because sometimes i feel like the books like the volume ones sometimes get you up to level four but i guess not for parenting i guess it only gets you up to level three which is fine so we'll just deal with that let's have him read the book we're gonna have to get the other book out actually but that's okay Gabriel is working on his school project, and Octavia is listening to music. So that's what everyone is doing. The royal family is actually pretty happy right now, which is good. I'm glad that everything is going well for them. And then we are, yeah, like I said, we need to get the other book, so that's fine. But that is um, with the Perryton family. That was the life ruining we were doing today. Sorry, Brian. His lipstick was always on point. Um, yeah, we're going to have Gabriel write in his journal a little bit more, and then he actually has to go to school. But when he gets home, we're going to get the mental skill up to level two so he can play that other game, and that'll be good. It's probably only, like, maybe two more videos, and then we'll have his birthday. I think his birthday is in, like, a week or something. I try to make these videos, like, you know, three-ish sim days each. But, you know. I think Winterfest is in the next one, so we'll have that. I did want things to be relatively calm while Gabriel was young. I wanted, you know, because Gohan had such a rough childhood and early young adulthood with the last generation's drama drama, so I wanted him to be able to have a little bit of, you know, peace and happiness while his child was young and then we will start ramping up as Gabriel gets older. We will have Gabriel have his own drama. Gohan's drama is pretty much over. He has already been through it. He doesn't have to go through anything else. You know, I do like to torment my Sims. However, not that bad. So um, also, yeah, I'm just going to buy money trees to put in our inventory for later. As you know, we do one money tree. We plant one money tree per um, coronation. So there's that, and Gabriel will be coming home soon. Yeah, see how the thing disappears? I don't know why it's like that, and I don't know how to fix it. And so, like, Gohan is not really advancing in his career for some reason. It's just so weird. But yeah, here, I'm looking for the charity party. There is not one listed. I don't know where it is. So I don't know what's up with that. Also, I can't delete the gig. I think there's a problem here. Um... 
Anyway, so let's invite everyone over just to see if we could ask them for charity, like for money for charity, but none of them have that option. I think it's like something in the political career or something, but you can't be in the political career and this royal family career. Anyway, I don't know. So here's some of the nobility over here. Look, there is Reese. We're going to talk to him. Reese is Octavia's nephew. He is the son of Natsu and Sunny. And if you remember Natsu, so Natsu is Gohan's sister. He also has a sister named Aki. Aki killed Natsu and stole her husband. So um, Reese is Reese is the um, you know the first child of Sunny and Natsu. And then um, Sunny and Aki had twin girls, Farah and that little purple one over there whose name I forget. <laughs> um, but yeah, so everything is going pretty well. I did want to try to get Gabriel to like talk to some of the other kids. Just like looking at our options. Actually, some of them are already becoming teenagers. Gabriel was like the last one born, so all the other kids are a little bit older than him. Maybe that's why they're not as close. So that's what's going on there. We're trying to talk to some of these kids, but it's not going super well. We'll have him uh, do his homework and have his mom help him with his homework. And then that we're done for the helping with homework part of his aspiration, which is good. Like, oh, hey, Diane. Diane's still sad. <laughs> She's like, my husband's dead. I don't know how it got to this. <laughs> um, yeah, it was a whirlwind, Diane. I mean, can you imagine you go to the bar to have an affair and then suddenly your affair partner is killing your husband? You know, that's how it goes. Here's the butler eating cake. <laughs> and yeah, so here we go. And there is the last helping with homework. And then we need to uh, play some games still on the computer. So that's good. But that is where we're going to wrap up. Basically, what happened in this one is Diane Perryton started an affair with Howard of Newcrest. And then he killed her husband. And now they're together. And, you know... We'll see that probably will crash and burn because he is really doing it in order to get a title and he's really not going to get that here. So sorry, Howard. Um, yeah, look at her face. <laughs> Scala is not happy about this arrangement. Anyway, back with the royal family. Everyone's just working on their aspirations, having a good time. We'll have Winterfest in the next one. And then, um, you know, Gabriel's going to be a teen soon. So we're going to have to get some aspirational stuff going and some drama drama going for him. So I'm really excited about that. And I hope you are too. So I... Hope that you enjoyed and I will catch you in the next one.